Today's video is about low cholesterol foods. If you would like to download a free guide on dealing with your cholesterol, then please click on the link in the description below this video. Also don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Low cholesterol foods. Summary, the fuzz about low cholesterol foods. So why all the stir about these low cholesterol foods? People have been talking about these like it's the best thing since DVD players. And why shouldn't they be? These low cholesterol foods are like God's answers to the prayers of persons with high cholesterol levels. They may not promise immortality but they certainly claim to contain healthy ingredients, or boast of the absence of harmful stuff, reducing the risks of heart disease, the United States' leading cause of death. So what really are low cholesterol foods? They are just the foods that have been stripped of their cholesterol content. Some other low cholesterol foods contain harmful fats, called trans fats, in the form of hydrogenated oils. These then contradicts the goal of lowering cholesterol levels. There are also low cholesterol foods that act as a cholesterol lowering tool by itself, which according to some experts can do more harm than good. Debates on whether low cholesterol foods are efficient aids in reducing heart disease risks have been ongoing for years. A lot of health experts have been throwing facts at each other hoping to support their studies, research, and beliefs. Much has been said about lowering cholesterol as a means to avoid heart diseases. The diet heart theory has been widely talked about and has convinced a lot of people. The theory claims that saturated fats and dietary cholesterol intake are two main culprits in raising your risks for heart problems. Suggestions like eating low cholesterol foods and taking in lowering cholesterol medications has been given to patients with high risk factors. However, there is fuzz about all these being myths. Other doctors have conducted research and extensive studies on lipid theory and have come up with results that verify the cholesterol myths. A certain doctor, in his book, identified the nine main myths of the lipid hypothesis, some of which are, high fat foods cause heart disease, high cholesterol foods cause heart disease, high fat foods raise blood cholesterol, and cholesterol blocks the arteries. Some studies which contradict the lipid hypothesis also point out that the artery is not blocked by cholesterol. The artery cells are believed to be under constant attack by different forces which damage the cells. Thus, the artery requires a stable supply of new collagen as replacement of the damaged cells. Vitamin C as a rich source of collagen has to be in abundant supply. In the absence of enough vitamin C to repair the cells, the artery will refer to the cholesterol to patch up the problem. Literally, cholesterol does that, as it is considered to be the body's band-aid. These contradicting studies have been very confusing to a lot of people. Low cholesterol foods have been thought of as angels, but have also been viewed as the devils. Reading widely may just point us to the most reliable answers. Thanks for watching and hoped you liked this short video. Please remember to subscribe and comment below so you are notified of videos when we release them. Also, don't forget to download the free advanced guide on dealing with your high cholesterol.